Ooh, it's battle cruiser. Battle cruiser operational. Battle cruiser operational. <laughs> Go Commodore. Receiving transmission. Receiving transmission. What's going on, my roadies? My name is Dustin, and welcome back to StarCraft Remastered. <laughs> uh, Brood War, Terran, part number two. I don't know why I had a, almost a mental brain fart there, but it's going to be a long day. Uh, I'm going to be recording quite a bit of videos today. Um, probably three StarCraft Remastered. Maybe. I don't know. At least two, though. Let's see how my voice goes. Uh, so let's get into it here. Let's see what we're doing. I think it's the Dilarian... D Dilarian Shipyards? I don't know how you pronounce that. It's probably Dilarian. UAD flagship Alexander holding perimeter orbit over the Dilarian Shipyards outlying Dominion Trade Center. Okay. Let's see what's going on. Receiving incoming transmission. Captain, Vice Admiral Stukov has informed me of your flawless sortie upon Braxis. I must commend you for beginning our campaign with such a decisive victory. Our attack teams have decrypted the Dominion's data link and have gained access to Ming's most guarded files. However, our work is not yet complete. We have ascertained the location of the Dilarian shipyards. These shipyards, serving as a fueling and repair station for the Dominion, house a number of functional battle cruisers in Drydock. To assure that our domination of this sector remains uncontested, you are to assault the shipyards and liberate as many of these capital ships as possible. Gentlemen, I recommend that you launch this attack using the utmost caution. Dominion Command can typically reinforce its outlying bases within 16 standard hours. You should expect some sort of reprisal from Emperor Mengs shortly. Ah, the turncoat. I suggest that you pay keen attention to rank when you address the captain and myself, Lieutenant Duran. Is that understood? Of course, Admiral. <laughs> You're beginning to show your age, Gerard. Give the boy some credit. He just tipped us off to a preeminent attack. However useful he may prove to be, Alexei, he will always be a traitor in my eyes. And you know that I cannot abide a traitor. Only too well, Gerard. Captain, when you are ready, you may commence with the operation. Once you have commandeered the enemy's battle cruisers, be prepared to repel the Dominion reinforcements when they arrive. I'm sorry, every time you said sheepyards, I just heard bah in my mind. Adjutant, what are you doing still here, girl? You broken? <laughs> Anyways, still battle cruisers or sheeps uh, defeat the Dominion Strike Force. It's it's just the Russian accent. Once your forces have landed, Captain, you'll need to escort our pilots to the battle cruisers themselves. They will be able to commandeer the ships and turn them over to our control. Okay. So we got some medics, marines, and pilots. All right, troops, listen up. Each squad will have a medic assigned to it to patch up the wounded, but that doesn't mean you can get careless. Stay frosty and get the job done. Okay. Okay, so we have heal, restoration, and optical flare. Okay, so restoration would be like... Actually, that's a great question. I don't know. But now we're going to be able to have Marines that have a longer lifespan now. Okay. One of you pilots go over here, please. I'd appreciate that. Ooh, it's Battle Cruiser. Battle Cruiser Operational. Battle Cruiser Operational. Go, Commodore! Wait. It has no hit points, meaning it can't be targeted. That's weird. Okay. Um, medics? I, I will admit, I am not a huge fan of the way that the, um, the pathing works in this game. That's the one thing that just really irks me. It's like, well, why, why was that the logical placement to go? That made, that made no sense. Did someone page me? State the nature of your 
<laughs> They're all like going after the one guy over there. It's crazy. It's so weird to finally be able to, to heal my units, you know? That's that's weird to me. I don't know why. I don't think there's anything else really over there. Um, hang on a second. Let me, there we go. Woo. Okay. Hey there. Sure thing. All right. Howdy. How y'all doing? What's up? Whoa. Okay, so I'm just done with those units now, I guess. Okay. So we have ghosts and we have medics. Never know what hit them. I hear that. I'm all over that. Uh, wow, I just realized I have 3-3. Three, three. Um... Um, it's F. Woo. Okay, so now he basically has a reduced sight range, I believave Okay. Come over here, medics. I need to get these ghosts in position as well. So now they shouldn't attack. Yeah. I think they have it like a reduced down to like one range or something like that. It's really, really sad to be honest. Nope, healer. Okay, it's A. Thanks a lot. Please don't move closer. Okay, I'm gonna put the ghost over there and lock down him. Flare. We good? Okay, I think we're good. Okay. Um, you guys come over here, please. That'd be nice. You go over there, and you go over there. Okay, let's put the ghost over this way. Let's try to try to avoid splash damage wherever possible. Flare. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and decloak those guys. Okay. Ah. I thought you guys flared. Oh, they did. How is that possible then? What? Excuse me? So it has a reduced range. It's it's not a one. My bad. Silos are secured. We got four nukes on standby. Awaiting your orders. I want more nukes than that. Okay, that's that's good, I suppose. Um, but okay. oh gosh. Um, so four nukes. Let's just go straight into nuke mode, shall we? Okay. Nope. Never mind. Okay, that should prevent it from being a detector, right? Yeah. So, in a lot of ways, this is just a way to um, to train you what the flares do, how to use medics properly. Any minute now. Forgot they took forever. Boom. Okay. Um. I can't heal. I can't heal Go or Goliath, so I probably shouldn't. I think this is pretty much secure now. Okay, so let's get two of you. One and two. Let's move it closer just to be the safe side. Okay, so let's go ahead and cloak and you know, like view up here. Um, looks like... 
Looks like there's a bunch of stuff over here. Let me just nuke right there. Put those guys over there. State the nature of your medical emergency. Call the shot. Systems functional. I'm here. I'm all over it. Boom. And then there's another nuke that we can land over there, so. Let me uh, grab another one of these nuky boys. Nuke right there. That's three nukes. I guess I can do. Oh, that's a. That's not a ghost. Should I waste the last one over here? I guess I'll do that. Wait. Hold on. Let's let's not be dumb about this now. Make that one. You guys are on five. Okay, let's let's just kind of push here, I guess. Yeah, with medics, it makes it a lot easier. <laughs> it makes it so much easier. Okay, so there's three left. I guess we can be a little bit, a uh, little bit aggressive here. I guess. How y'all doing? Woo. I'm going. No. Are you guys? You guys are on five. Okay, everybody, just stop. Hold. Let that guy go, please, please. Okay, that's twelve. How many more do we need? Um, here comes the restoration. Medic, restore us. Okay. All right. Uh, we have more ghosts now again. How many more battle cruisers are we? Oh my gosh, this map is huge. Okay. So I guess. Let's see. We'll do those. That. That. Guys, get up there. You're not that dumb, are you? Okay, let's kind of scout out ahead. Hopefully, they don't have detectors on the high ground. Oh, that siege tank, though. What? You want to explain something to me over here? Can you hit him from there? Wait, do they have detectors over there? How did he see me? I don't know. This is not going well, by the way, in case anybody was wondering. Okay. Ghost, please. They do. It's that science vessel there. Oh, no, 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 back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Need medical attention? Uh, State the nature of your medical thank you. Ghost I hear that. Of course, these ghosts are like, Marine, get up there. I'm all over it. I'm all over it. And attack. State the nature of your medical we'll just decloak there. Whoa, no, 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 get away. Oh boy. Okay. You want to keep? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. Good idea. Everybody, just hold position, please. Okay. Man. 
I feel like if I try to do that, they're all just gonna die off anyway, so. Okay, I have enough for one more lockdown. I watched him get hit by that siege tank up there again. Well, I guess I don't have vision no more. Okay, I should be safe where I'm at. Nope. Where's that siege? Oh, really? 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 Okay, you guys go over here. Battle cruiser operational. Battle cruiser operational. Right, it was O, not E. I could change the hotkeys. I very well could, but you know, I'm, I'm being lazy. I don't really care that much. So, stop, 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 stop. Okay, I guess we'll just move on forward just slightly, hopefully. I already took a lot of damage, so it just kind of sucks. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick, just because I'm afraid that I'm gonna lose one of these bad boys here, so... Keep accidentally hitting tab as well, by the way. Um, medic, can we get you in here, please? How y'all doing? No sweat. Okay, so let's blind him. Run, little dude, run! Woo. I think that was a siege tank, if that being the case. Okay, let me get these guys close enough to this science vessel to hopefully not take damage. Okay, we're gonna slowly chip away at him here. He still provides vision. He doesn't, he's not a detector, but he still provides vision, which is a problem. So, I guess we just sit here and wait. These druggies over here. There we go. Okay, so you, eh. Um. Did someone page me? Okay, y'all go back, please. Okay, so I have enough for two lockdowns, one on each. Please be no detectors. Okay. See, let's siege up right there. Siege up. Nope, that's too close. That's too close. Back up. Back up. No! Oh, I underestimate the range of the siege tank. Oh gosh. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay. Decloak, please. I have one more siege tank left. Siege tank in a dream, I guess. I can't queue that up. Are you serious? Okay, fine. Uh, I think this is more than enough range for this. No. Is that close enough? Thank you. I don't believe there was anything else over here. There was a science vessel, but I killed that. So I doth believe this is it. Whew. 
Okay. Come over here, little guys. Ah, that's the stuff. I sure hope there's no other siege tank down here. Is there a... No, there was no other way, just that way. Okay. Identify target. We have 17 battle cruisers. We go ahead and save. We're about to get 18, which is a control group and a half for some reason. Captain, Hello. We are tracking a large fleet of Dominion ships in your vicinity. Ah, this must be the reinforcements that Lieutenant Duran warned us about. Captain, prepare our newly acquired fleet to battle the intruders. Receiving transmission. Receiving transmission. Healing frequencies open. All crews reporting. All right. Transmission. Take it slow. All crews reporting. Bam 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 bada bam 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 bada bam 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 Captain, we are being hailed by the Dominion flagship NORAD 3. Well now, I don't know which militia y'all are from, but I advise you to back down now. I'm General Edmund Duke of the Dominion Armada, and in the name of Emperor Max, I order you to surrender your forces immediately and unconditionally. Ah, General Duke. I expected your forces to arrive sooner. You should know that we represent not one of your ragtag peasant militias, but the combined might of the United Earth Directorate. Earth Directorate? You mean to tell me you've come all the way out here from Earth? That is correct, General. We're here to take control over this sector and its occupants for the betterment of mankind. Over my dead body. I don't care where you're from, son. No one pushes around the Terran Dominion on my watch. All units, fire at will. Receiving transmission. So there's this weird thing of, oh, you guys are from Earth? Receiving transmission. What do you mean by that? Oh boy. Kinda like grabbing a couple at random here. Um, I, I selected two. Huh, only lost three. Not bad. Not bad at all. But it brings up the question. Y'all are from Earth. Why are why y'all come out here from Earth? Where are we? <laughs> I know it's Caprulu's sector, technically speaking. But, like, we're in the known universe, or unknown universe, because it is a sci-fi game. It could be an unknown universe sort of thing. Anyways, uh, enough of that, though. All right, so that's going to call this episode. I saw at the very end Ruins of Tarsonis. Tarsona seems to be a very popular place to go to, um, but I don't know. We'll find out what it means by the ruins of Tarsonis. Obviously, something bad happened. I think it was the Zerg invasion with the Psy emitter and whatnot, so the UED is trying to figure out what the heck has happened out here. But we, having played the original and now Brood War, kind of know what's going on. And I love uh, the universe that it's built so far, and after having played StarCraft 2 so much, to go back to Remastered, a lot of the lines are, like, making a lot more sense now to me. I don't know why, but after all these years of not playing StarCraft Remastered and going back to it now, it's like, yeah, that is true. That did happen. Wow. <laughs> so, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I really do appreciate it, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Cheers. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, check out some of my other videos too. Are you new around here? Consider subscribing and turning on channel notifications so you get notified when I upload more. Thanks again and have a great day.